that is powerful welcome to church today Ina nguvu na karibuni sana kanisani leo. We are happy to see you. Tunayo furaha kwa kuwaona. Those who are joining us online. Wale ambao mnaunganika nasi katika mtandao. You are most welcome for this blessing. Mekaribisha sana mali hapa. I'm sure you will never be the same again. Nina uhakika ya kwamba hutakuwa vile tena. Amen. Amen. Where is children are gathered in unity? Hali ambapo watoto wake mkusanyika katika umoja. The Bible says he commands his blessing. Biblia inasema kwamba anaamrisha baraka. And I can give you an assurance. Anaweza kupatia uhakikisho. The blessing of the Lord has already been commanded. Baraka za Bwana tayari zimeamrishwa. No power of opposition can stop it. Hakuna nguvu za upinzani zaweza kuizuia. No power of sorcery can stop it. Hakuna nguvu za uchawi zinaweza kuzuia. The blessing is already commanded. Baraka tayari imeamrishwa. Begin to tap into that blessing. Anza kupokea kutoka kwa hiyo baraka. In the mighty name of the Lord. Kwa jina kuu la Bwana. Today I have a topic as you stand like that. Leo hii niko na mada mkiwa umesimama hivyo. Um the topic is uh, walking in divine advancement. Basi uh, kichwa ni kutembea katika kuendelea kwa kiungu. You are advancing. Wewe unaendelea and the grace of advancement is coming upon you provoked by the supernatural so from now henceforth you are going to walk in that grace the grace of advancement and I want us to do a hymn which talks about advancing in Swahili Swahili ambao naongea kuhusu kuendelea. Ah uh, Mangela you can lead us in uh, mbele ninaendelea. Oh, my God. 
somebody declare that you shall advance declare that you shall advance in a supernatural way we came to this house today because we shall under, uh, 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 advance we shall not remain in the same level we are moving to another level somebody make a prayer refuse to remain the same you were meant for advancement you were redeemed to advance refuse every spirit that hinders advancement in the mighty name of the Lord whatever it is wherever it is coming from is it a sickness is it an embedment of a nature we are here to declare we are advancing the church is advancing the families are advancing Sultan Amod is advancing we are advancing in our careers we are advancing spiritually we are advancing in wealth we are advancing in health somebody make a declaration because of that declaration you shall not be the same again something is happening in the house levels are changing in the mighty name of the Lord we are tired of the same thing we are tired of repetition we declare a season of advancement in the mighty name of the Lord the devil is a liar the devil is a liar we shall not revolve in the same thing father we thank you hear the cry of your children hear the cry of the women hear the cry of the men hear the cry of the youth hear the cry of the Sundays to children hear the cry of the worshippers hear the cry of the pastors hear the cry of the grandparents hear the 
the cry of the old men and the old women remember mercy today remember mercy today your mercies are new every morning we invoke new mercies mercies for advancement in the mighty name of the Lord Father we thank you and we honor you thank you for the anointing the anointing for advancement upon everybody joining us we declare that grace that grace by the mercies of God the grace of advancement help us to walk in that grace we thank you God one more time Some of you have mountains to climb. The voice of the Lord is saying, you are not to climb by your strength. The Lord is giving you strength. This is a deep revelation. I don't know who that person is. But somebody came today. They have mountains to climb. Just make a prayer today. You are climbing that mountain. You are climbing that mountain. The Lord is lifting you. Who are you mountain? Before Zerubbabel. It is not by mighty. It is not by power. But by the spirit. May the spirit of the Lord. Overshadow your life. And they give you strength. To climb that mountain. I feel like we need to pray. Every economic mountain. Every family mountain. Every career mountain. Father we come before you. We declare today. Everybody under my voice. He's going to climb every mountain. He's going to climb every mountain. Whatever it is. We came to announce. We are crossing over. We are crossing over. However big it is. We are crossing. In the name of Jesus. Somebody pray in the spirit. Pray in tongues if you can. Some power is coming upon you. Some anointing is coming upon you. To strengthen you to advance. On the way there shall be mountains. There shall be valleys. There shall be rivers to cross. I don't know what they are. I don't know what I'm saying. The Lord shall be with you. The Lord shall be with you. However tough the way is. 
However tough the journey is The Lord shall be with you There is a lot of evidence here Because some of you don't know what is happening And the war is going to happen But deliverance Is in the house Deliverance Is in the house Thank you God what is the Lord telling him? He is going to be with you. One more time in the spirit, Ebuana. Thank you for the grace, the grace to advance, the grace to new frontiers, the grace to new territories. We thank you for the grace, that grace of advancement. Father, speak to us, strengthen us, and minister to us. In Jesus' name, we do pray and believe. Amen. Amen. Give the Lord a hand clap. Amen. Amen. We may take our seats in the presence of the Lord. Let us appreciate the worship team. Amen. Amen. When I was uh, thinking of what to, to speak today, the Lord led me to this word. Some years back we were on our year of advancement as CCI. That is CCI in the world. And uh, as I tried to avoid it because it was there before. The Lord insisted that we come and share on Walking in divine advancement. You can remove that. You just leave, say, walking in divine advancement. Uh, Exodus 14, 13 to 15. God is talking to Moses to speak to the children of Israel. Moses answered the people, do not be afraid. I came to tell the church this morning. Do not be afraid. Amen. Amen. Stand firm and you will see the deliverance the Lord will bring to you today. The Egyptians you see today, you will never see them again. Simameni tu mkawone wokovu wabwana atakao wafanyia leo. 
Kwa maana hao wa Misri mlio waona leo hamtawaona tena milele. Let this word jump from the, the red book. Wacha ili neno liruke kutoka kitabu chekundu and enter your heart. Na likaingie katika moyo wako. And I want to say it with finality. Na ningependa kuisema kwa mwisho na uwezo wote. The enemies of advancement that you see today you will never see them again. Maadui wa kuendelea ambao unawaona siku ya leo hutawahi kuwaona tena. Some of you have been trying to move forward. Wengine wenu mmejaribu kusonga mbele. To advance. Ili mkapate kuendelea. In various ways. Katika njia tofauti. But something has stood against you. Lakini kitu kimesimama kukuzuia. And you have seen it. Na umekiona. Stood against your children. Kimesimama kinyume na watoto wako. Stood against your life. Kimesimama kinyume na maisha yako. I came to say today. Nilikuja kusema leo. That thing you have been seeing. Hicho kitu ambacho umekuwa ukiona. And I declare this prophetically. Na nitatangaza hii kwa kumbi. You will never Hallelujah. You will never see it again. Hutawai kukiona mara tena. Let this go to record. Wacha hii kaende katika kuwa. You can put it in the bank. Unaweza kuiweka kwenye. You shall never see them again. Hutawai kuwaona tena. Verse number 15. Sari wa kumina. 14. Sari wa kumina nne. The Lord will fight for you. Bwana Mungu atakupigania. Are you hearing what the Lord is saying? Nasikia vile Bwana anasema. The Lord will fight for you. Bwana Mungu atawapigania ninyi. Even he said. Mungu anasema. The battle ahead of you is not yours. Vita hiyo ambavyo iko mbele yako si vyako. It belongs to the Lord. Yenyewe ni vya Mungu. And the Lord will fight for you. Naye Bwana Mungu atakupigania. You need one thing. Unahitaji kitu kimoja. Be still. He huwe unatulia. I choose to be still. Mimi nachagua kutulia. Because the Lord will fight for us. Kwa sababu Bwana Mungu atatupigania. Last verse 15. He wa mwisho mstari wa 15. There is a word I want to choose there. Unalo neno ambalo nataka kuichagua hapa. Then the Lord said to Moses. Basi Bwana akamwambia Musa why are you crying out to me? Bona unanililia mimi. Tell the Israelites. Waambie wana wa Israeli. This is simple language. Sasa hii ni lugha Tell the Israelites. Ambia wana wa Israeli. And you know ahead of them. Na unajua mbele yao. There was a red sea. Ulikuwa na bahari ya shamu. Physically it was not possible. Eh kwa hali asilia haikuwa na proceed. Kuendelea. I can see some of you are seeing a mountain. Naona wengine wenu wanaona mlima. You are seeing something that you cannot move it. Unaona kitu ambacho hauwezi kukisukuma. But the Lord has told me to tell you. Lakini Bwana ameniambia nikuambie. To move on. Wewe endelea mbele. Hallelujah. Amen. Move on. Endelea mbele. Continue to advance. Endelea kusonga. Whatever the case is. Hata kama mambo yako na Whatever the hindrance is. Hata kama kizuizi ni Whatever the obstacle. Hata kama kizuizi Continue to move. Wewe endelea kusonga. Choir move on. Choir endeleeni mbele. Women move on. Wanawake songeni mbele. Men move on. Wanaume endeleeni. The youth move on. Wanarika songeni mbele. Children move on. Watoto endeleeni mbele. Hallelujah. Let your family move on. Wacheni familia zenu zenu. Move on with your business. Eleeni mbele na business. Move on with your career. Eleeni mbele na tarumbeni. Move on with your vision. Eleeni mbele na tunaona. Let CCI Sultan move on. Acha kanisa la CCI Sultan endelee mbele. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. It does not matter what is ahead of you, what is obstructing you, what is blocking you, but heaven is saying, move on, there is hope ahead, there is victory ahead, there is overcoming ahead, there is peace ahead, things are good ahead, there is no problem ahead, move on. Church. Somebody say amen. Genesis 13, 14. God speaking to, to, to Abraham. Mungu akiongea na Ibrahimu. The Bible says. Biblia inasema. Genesis 13, 14. Eh, mwanzo kumina net, eh, kumina tatu. The Lord said to Abraham. 
after Lot had parted from him, lift up your eyes from where you are and look north and the south, east and the west. Bwana akamwambia Abrahamu alipokwisha kutengana na Lutu, inua sasa macho yako ukatazame kutoka hapo ulipo upande wa kaskazini na wa kusini na wa begin to look with your spiritual eyes anza kutazama na macho yako ya kiroho begin to see where the lord is taking you anza kuona ni wapi bwana anakupeleka in a vision look at the north katika maono basi angalia upande wa kaskazini in a vision look at the south katika maono angalia upande wa kusini look at the east angalia mashariki look at the west angalia magharibi verse 15 sari wa 15 in a vision katika maono oh the land that you see inji yote ambayo unaiona the essence of moving forward sababu ya kusonga mbele is to possess what you can see ni kumiliki kile ambacho unaona oh the land that you see inji hiyo yote unayoiona heaven is saying bibu inasema i will give to you nitakupa wewe and your offspring na uzao wako i want to declare a serious blessing nataka kutangaza baraka za kumaanisha the blessing coming upon your church baraka ambazo zinakuja juu yako is not for you alone si zako peke many years miaka mingi pastor when you will not be there wachungaji wakati ambapo utakuwa the blessing of the lord will stand the test of time baraka ya bwana itaweza kusimama hata kidumbi it is going to be there for you children it is going to be there for your children's children when you see me i want you to see generations when you hear me speaking i want you to know i'm speaking for generations people may want to play around with you you are enemies and you are sorcerers the enemies of god may try to play around with you but i came to declare oh what you can see with your spiritual eyes as you and advance and possess it is going to be for you and your children and your children's children and your generation in the name of jesus that is why you are connected to this important altar the kind of a package of a blessing which is coming upon you is for you and your children that is why your daughter has been fought left and right that is why your son has been fought left and right because the blessing does not belong to him it is about you and your children and your children's children from this outer we declare generational blessings for a thousand generations in the mighty name of the Lord anybody connected with this altar is about to enjoy not only a season of blessing but a generational blessing may the Lord deliver you may the Lord deliver your children may the Lord deliver your grandchildren because the blessing is going to be there for generations this I declare in the name of the Father, part of the Son, part of the Holy Ghost. Can somebody make a joyful noise unto the Lord? Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Something great is about to happen. Oh that you see. I know some of you saw and forgot. You forgot that you were to dominate some space in France. You forgot. You forgot that you saw international blessings. You forgot. I have come to resound the vision. I declare a resounding of that vision Oh that which you can see I came to declare And verse Against all the hordes And verse Against the tides There is no fierce pass 
We are advancing against adversity. The enemy is not happy when you are advancing. But you have a prophet with you in the house who has come to declare you shall advance against every opposition. In the mighty name of the Lord, I came to speak to all the enemies of advancement. Enemies of your family. Enemies of your children. Enemies of your career. I came to speak to them now. They must make way so that the king can pass. Listen to me, you gates. Hindering the children of God. You must make a way. Be thou lifted. Gates fighting the children of God. Be thou lifted. Iron gates. I command you now to give way for the king to pass. You are going to pass as you advance. Nothing can stop you. Nothing can stand against you. Nothing can fight your destiny. We came to make a declaration. We came to make an announcement that whatever looked impossible now is becoming possible because the season we are entering in is a season of divine advancement. May the Lord give you the breakthrough. May the Lord fill you with power. May the Lord fill you with anointing to overcome every adversity who has been fighting your destiny in the mighty name of the Lord. We have a God. I say we have a God. We have a God. God of Abraham. God of Isaac. God of Jacob. God of Peter Kilonzo. He is our God. He is going to fight our battles. And we are going to break through. We are going to break through. We are going to reach the other end. In the mighty name of the Lord. If you believe it. I want you to declare prophetically. That you are advancing to that place. You are advancing to your destiny. You are advancing from today. I don't care what has been fighting you. But you are advancing. I said you are advancing. I said you are advancing. I said you are advancing. You better make a declaration. That you are advancing. To your next level. In the mighty name of the Lord. We must move on. We must move on. We must move on. Our children must move on. Our brothers must move on. Our sisters must move on. We must move on. We must move on. We must move on. We must advance. We must go. Zalala Baba Zikala Magandabo Ikala Bagandabo It is a must it is a must. The men will advance. The women will advance. Our children will advance. The weakest will advance. Ah, the weakest people will advance. It is a must for us to advance. Receive the grace. Receive the grace. Receive the grace. The grace for advancement. Receive it in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Somebody celebrate Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Sit down for some time. Let me say this. Advancement is 
the act of moving forward dicho kini cha kwenda mbele the act of moving forward hilo tendo la kusonga mbele it is the act of recording noticeable increase ni tendo la kuandika mabadiliko ambayo yanaonekana noticeable increase e kuongezeka ambako kunaonekana that is what is going to happen to you hiyo ndio itatendeka kwako there shall be a noticeable increase utakuwa na kuongezeka kunakotambulika something that can be seen kitu ambacho kinaweza kuonekana noticeable e kinaweza kutambulika the kuonekana. devil can do nothing about it shetani hawezi akifanyia jambo so noticeable increase kwa hivyo kuongezeka ambako kunatambulikana koma e koma progress and enlargement kuendelea pamoja na kupanuka yes that is now advancement sasa hiyo ndio kuenda mbele i continue to talk naendelea na kuone kuongea advancement Kuendelea. is living where you are ni kuongoza mahali ulipo living kutoka e, kutoka mahali ulipo hmm. so living where you are ni kutoka mahali ulipo to where you ought to be wenda mahali ambapo wafaa kuwa listen to me church nisikilizeni kanisa there is a place you ought to be kuna mahali ambapo wastahili kuwa and for you to go where you ought to be na kwako kwenda mahali ambapo wastahili kuwa you must live where you are ni lazima utoke mahali ulipo that is why we are here today na hii ndio sababu tuko hapa leo to catapult you from your status quo to go where you ought to be kukufukuza mahali ulipo kwenda mahali wastahili kuwa even if it means praying for you hata kama itakuwa ni kukuombea even if it means holding your hand hata kama inamaanisha kushika mkono wako even if it means doing a harambe hata kama inamaanisha kufanya harambe to remove you where you are kukuondoa mahali ulipo to put you where you belong kukuweka mahali ambapo unastahili in life and the destiny e, katika hatima yako yeah in your life and the destiny katika maisha yako na hatima yako to advance means to look around kuendelea ni kuangalia pale kando kando ulipo and realize na kutambua looking around kuangalia hapo katika looking at your ulipo. spiritual life kuangalia maisha yako ya kiroho looking at your career kuchunguza ile taaluma yako looking at your friends kuangalia marafiki zako looking at where you live kuangalia mahali ambapo unaishi looking at your disposition and you say and you realize that you have changed level and the class kuangalia vile ulivyo na basi unasema ya kwamba umebadilisha kiwango chako na daraja lako noticeable e ambayo inaonekana some people seated here watu wengine ambao wameketi hapa in a six months dispensation e kwa muda wa miezi sita their class darasa lao their level kiwango chao Yeah sasa that is now the class their class kiwango chao their status ile hadhi yao their income ule ile mapato yao their spiritual placement ule kuwekwa kwao kwa kiroho i came to declare nilikuja kutangaza it will never be the way it is today haitakuwa vile ilivyo leo from this outer kutoka kwenye madhabahu we are speaking advancement tunaongea kwenda mbele receive it ipoke in the mighty name of the lord mashina kula bwana may your class and the level church enda raja lako na na kiwango chako kibandike let me give you some keys to advancement wacha nikupatie funguo za kuendelea i may just do one key today naweza kushughulikia ufunguo moja leo so key number one is the key of vision ufunguo wa kwanza ni ufunguo wa maono proverbs 29:18 Nadhali 29 mstari wa 18 That is why this year we are resounding the vision. Hii ndio sababu mwaka huu tunarudi kwenye maono. The key of vision. Ufunguo wa maono. Ah uh, Give me KJV. Nipatie KJV. There is a word we are looking for. The 
where there is no vision pasipo na maono yes where we lack vision pale ambapo tuna ukosefu wa maono the people perish watu huangamia i feel like fighting the spirit of perishing na hisi kama kupigana na roho wa kuagamia nobody under my voice hakuna aliye chini ya sauti yangu nobody under my voice hakuna aliye chini ya sauti yangu shall perish ataangamia because in you kwa sababu ndani yako we are releasing a vision tunaachilia maono but he that keepeth the law happy is he bali anaheri mtu yule aishikaye sheria message bible biblia ya message the computer became slow nowadays if people can't see what god is doing kama watu hawezi wakaona kile mungu anafanya that is interesting uh -huh. if people can't see what god is doing kama watu hawezi kuona kile mungu anafanya that is vision sasa hayo ni maono vision is seeing what god is doing maono ni kuona kile mungu anafanya they stumble all over themselves wanajikwa wa wenyewe i love this version napendezwa na ina but when they attend to what he reveals lakini wanaposhughulikia kile ambacho wanafunua they are most blessed wao wanabarikiwa zaidi sana number one ya kwanza i declare today natangaza leo you shall see what god is doing wewe utaona kile bwana anafanya and you shall not stumble over yourself na wewe hutajikwaza mwenyewe number 2 ya pili you will attend you will work on the revelation of god wewe utafanyia kazi ule ufunuo wa mungu which is a vision ambayo ndio maono when that happens hiyo ikitendeka number 3 ya tatu my dear son e mwanangu you shall be most blessed may this happen to you in Jesus name we make some few notes divine advancement is powered by vision basi kuendelea kwa kiungu kunatiwa nguvu na maono You know there are things which power others unajua kuna mambo ambayo yanatia mengine nguvu na uwezo you can't advance without seeing where you are going awezi ukaendelea kama uoni pale ambapo unaenda but when you see where you are going lakini ukiona pale ambapo unaenda the vision is going to power your advancement maono yatatia nguvu kuendelea kwako when god wants to advance your life wakati mungu anataka kuendeleza maisha yako Any time God wants to advance your life. Wakati wote Mungu anapotaka kuendeleza maisha yako. And can I confirm now he wants to advance you. Na naweza kudhibitishia kwamba sasa anataka kukuendeleza. He advises you on the area of your vision for life. Anakushauri mahali pako pa maono yako ya maisha. That is why he has sent me today to come and advise you on the area of vision na ndipo amenituma leo nilije kushauri na kuonyesha mahali pako pa maono he will advise you on that area atakushauri katika mahali pale and another bullet vision is insight into the future na basi mahali pengine maono ni kuona siku za baadaye actually a mental picture of the actual future Akika ni picha ya kiakilini ya siku za baadaye that insight into the future huo huko kuona kwa siku za baadaye and a mental picture of the actual future na akila na picha ya akilini ya, ya kile ambacho kitatendeka siku za baadaye i want you to begin to see ningependa uanze kuona what the lord is about to do kile bwana yuko tayari kufanya the lifting which is coming over you ule kuinuliwa ambao kunakuja juu yako college students see greatness watoto katika taasisi muone ukuu see the greatness of your grades muone ukuu wa neema yako form 4 candidates see your heirs coming 
Wanafunzi wa kidato cha 4 muone azenu zikija. Mother see your provision. Akina mama muone utoshelezi wenu. See your daughters in great places. Muone mabinti zenu wakiwa mahali ambapo ni pakuu. See your sons coming back in a mighty way. Muone wana wenu wakiwarudia kwa njia iliyo kuu. Anything can happen to somebody of vision. Chochote chaweza kumtendekea mtu wa maono. I give you five key importance or significance of vision. Niwapatie mambo matano ya muhimu ya maono. Number 1. Ya kwanza, vision shows us where we are headed. Maono yanatuonyesha pale ambapo tunaenda. We want to have this vision. Tunataka kuwa na maono haya. To take us to where we are going. Yatupeleke pale ambapo tunaenda. That is one. Hiyo ni ya kwanza. Number B. Ya ba. It inspires us Ina, to keep on going. Ina tutia moyo na nguvu ili tuzidi kwenda. So somebody with a vision is inspired. Kwa hivyo mtu ambaye uko na maono yeye anawishwa. What has kept here is vision. Kile ambacho kimehifadhi hapa ni maono. We are moving to the other side to do a cathedral because of vision. Tunavuka ile ngambo nyingine tukafanye tukajenga hekalu kwa sababu ya maono. We can't get tired. Hatuwezi tukachoka. Because we are seeing what the Lord is going to do. Kwa sababu tunaona vile Bwana ataenda kufanya. Number C. Ya cha. It helps us to overcome obstacles. Inatusaidia inatusaidia kushinda vizuizi. That is what a vision can do. Hivyo ndivyo maono yanaweza kufanya. When you are seeing where you are going, unapoona pale ambapo unaenda, your angle cannot stop you from moving forward. Ami yako hawezi akakuzuia kwenda mbele. Your boss cannot put you down. Kubwa wako hawezi akakuweka chini. Because you know where you are going. Kwa sababu unajua pale unaenda. Number D, ya da. It provides what I am calling focus. Inatosheleza ama inakupa kile ambacho kinaitwa ni mtazamo. You stay on course. Unasalia katika njia ya sawa because of a vision. Kwa sababu ya maono. So vision will make you to stay on course. Kwa hivyo maono yatakusababisha ukakae katika njia ya sawa. You will never derail to go out. Wewe hautatoka nje. You remain on course. Utasalia katika njia ya. If you are loving God, you love him forever. Kama unampenda Bwana, utampenda milele. Nobody can remove you from God. Hakuna mtu ambaye anaweza kukuondoa kwa Mungu because you are focused. Kwa sababu wewe una mwelekeo. The last one. Ya mwisho. It gives you meaning. Inakupatia umaana and purpose. Na lengo to what you do. Kwa kile ambacho unafanya. It gives you meaning. Inakupatia umaana and purpose. Na kusudi to what you do. Kwa kile ambacho unafanya. That dose is almost enough. Eh hiyo dos iko karibu kukuwa sawa. If today I can release the power of vision upon your life. Kama leo hii ningeachilia nguvu za maono juu yako, then I will find you and advancing into your destiny. Basi nitakupata ukiendelea kuingia katika hatima yako. Your language will change. Lugha yako itabadilika. You will begin to speak. Wewe utaanza kuongea. Like somebody who is going somewhere. Kama mtu ambaye anaenda mahali. When others are sitting to discuss defeat. Wakati wengine wameketi kujadiliana juu ya kushindwa. You shall be sitting to discuss advancement. Wewe utakuona keti kujadiliana kuhusu kuendelea mbele. I want to give you few seconds. Nataka kupatia sekunde chache. Look at your spiritual future. Angalia eh, siku zako za baadaye za kiroho and then develop a focus. Na ukuze mtazamo. Look at your physical life. Angalia maisha yako ya asilia. Develop a vision. Na ukakuze maono. Look at your family. Angalia jamii yako. Develop a vision. Na ukuze maono. Look at your career. Angalia taaluma yako. Develop a vision. Na utengeneze maono. If you are a businessman. Kama wewe ni mwanaume. See where you are going. Angalia pale unaenda. If you are a career woman. Kama wewe ni mwanamke. See where you are heading to. Angalia pale ambapo unaenda. If you are a student. Kama wewe ni mwanafunzi. See where you are going to. Angalia 
If you want to get married, have a vision and begin to advance in the mighty name of the Lord. I want to close at that. I thought I can do another one more key. But we can meet here either on Friday or Sunday. And we continue with the keys. Thank you God. Somebody will advance today. Desire to advance. Whoever has been fighting your advancement. I silence them today. In the mighty name of the Lord. Even death. Which can come. Even death. Can you open a bit? That's why it's not get even death. Hata kifo. I said even death. Nimesema hata kifo. Which comes to curtail somebody's vision. Ambacho kinakuja kukata maono ya mtu. Shall not prosper over you. Hakita faulu juu yako. And I want to declare as I always do. Na ninataka tangaza kama vile ninafanya. Nobody under my voice. Hakuna aliye chini ya sauti. Shall die prematurely. Ata kufa kifo cha mapema. You shall live. Wewe utaishi ha. I said you shall live. Nimesema utaishi. To declare the praises of the Lord. Kutangaza sifa zake Bwana. Spirit of premature death. Roho wa kifo cha mapema. We bind your power. Tuna in the name of Jesus Spirit of losing your mind Confusion and frustration Disappointment of every kind I break it right now In the name of Jesus Every outer of darkness Fighting your advancement It is, an, it is under my feet it is under my feet in the name of Jesus every enemy fighting your children I put them under my feet in the mighty name of the Lord no ancestral spirit is permitted no ancestral spirit is permitted we refuse it. It is not permitted. What is that? Shala Bagandaba. Rika Tamuliada. No power of darkness. No power of darkness is permitted to destroy your future. Somebody break it. You are anointed to break it. You are redeemed to advance. Receive the redemption for advancement in the name of Jesus. No power of darkness shall fight your children. Somebody pray for your children. Pray for your children. Even if you don't have children. Pray for your future children. In the mighty name of the Lord. The devil has no permission. The sorcerers have no permission. To fight your children. Their schemes and plans. And defeated today. You shall not bury your children. You shall not bury your children. You shall not bury your children. In the name of Jesus. You shall not bury them. 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 I refuse it. You shall not bury your grandchildren. 
I refuse it. They are the one to bury you. When your time comes, not for you to bury them prematurely. I refuse it. In the name of Jesus. Mangela mbele ni naendele. Oh, Zote maombi o yasiki e bwana lift up your hands to heaven e bwana e bwana o ni the lord is lifting you the lord is lifting you bwana mungu anakuinua Sing again, Ebuana. Speak advancement over your life. You shall advance with all the limitations, with all the challenges. You are going to your next level in the mighty name of the Lord. I feel somebody I say. Reverend, you may not know, but I have gone through it all. I have tried to advance, but the opposition has been too much. I have looked behind. I saw enemies pursuing me. I looked ahead. I saw a Red Sea. But Reverend, you are telling me to move on. If you are sure you are in a catch, this is not about everybody. Why can't you change the microphone? Unajua kwamba nyuma yako kuna vitu, mbele yako kuna vitu, na unaviona vizuri na uko na maono, na unasema nataka ni toke kwa hii. Uyu ni mtu speciali, sio kila mtu, uyu ni mtu anaona mambo sio raisi. Nataka kuombea huyo inua mkono. Not everybody. Si kwa kila mtu. Just come here. Kuja hapa mbele. Come here. Come I pray for you. Kuja ni kuombe. Something is going to happen. Kitu kitatendeka. And I never called everybody. Just those who can see. Na mimi siku itakila mtu wale tu ambao wanaweza. A very serious entrance. E kizuizi cha kumanisha. Ahead there is an entrance. Bele yao kuna kizuizi. Behind there is another one. Yuma kuna kingine. And you are saying I want to advance. Na unasema nataka kuenda mbele. But this is not easy. Lakini hii si rahisi. I will pray for you. Neta kuombea. I want all the ones I'm praying to be on one line. In the name of Jesus. When I pray for you. Something is going to break. And a miracle is going to happen. This will be a story of the past. Wale mmekuja mbele anza kuomba Anza kuombia njambo hivu Linavunjika mchana wale Shalala balabala Wanaka 
anza kujipeana hata wale tulio kule nyuma tuanze kuomba katika jina la Yesu tunavunja kila kizuizi katika jina la Yesu vizuizi vinavunjika vizuizi vinavunjika katika maisha yako katika jina la Yesu I break every hindrance to your advancement. It breaks today in the mighty name of the Lord. Zalabalabalaba. Rika tamada nabo. Shalalaba ganabo. Ika tamazika ya. Ina funji kaleo. Kariga china la yesu. Kila kizuizi. Ambacho kimeinuka kinyume na maisha yako raba kata baba riba za kalabalaba and the is your portion in the name of Jesus you shall advance you shall advance raba na mana mana ma riba kata lalaba every chain breaks Every chain breaks. Raba kata la laba. Kila kizu izi kina fujika. Gariga china la yesu. I release you to your advancement. Na kuachilia. Wende mbele. Wende mbele. Sio nyuma. Na sio kubaki katikati. Enda mbele. Gariga china la yesu. Na kuachilia mchana wa leo. I release you to your advancement. Raba na makata la laba. Bwana anakuambia utubu kila kitu. Na unafunguliwa kutoka kwa ancestral spirits. Na zivunja. Na zikemea. Na ziaribu. Katika china la yeshu. Zinavunjika. Zinavunjika. Whatever it is, whatever the entrance, whatever the outer, I now break it. I now break it in the name of Jesus. I speak advancement over you, man of God. You shall advance. You shall advance because every entrance, every enemy. He is broken and the power of opposition he is broken in the name of Jesus receive your breakthrough to advance your breakthrough to advance pokea leo katika jina la yesu pokea neema ya kushonga mbele tunavunja kila milima na kila adui na kila miziko inakatika katika jina la yesu na kuachilia ndugu ukashonga mbele na vunja kila vizuizi wacha vikaondoke katika jina la Yesu you shall advance in the name of Jesus unasonga mbele kuanzia leo na kila ile ya kizuizi na kivunja katika jina la Yesu pokea hiyo neema katika jina la Yesu na achilia kibali cha kushonga mbele katika jina la Yesu mapepo yote na nguvu za ngiza na mambo ya zamani yaliyokushika yanaondoka katika jina la Yesu ondokewa na kila kizuizi na kuachilia ushonge mbele ndugu yangu shonga mbele sana in the name of Jesus i break every power and every work of the enemy in the name of Jesus i now release your breakthrough your breakthrough your breakthrough Receive it and advance in the name of Jesus. Every power fighting you, fighting your destiny, fighting your advancement. I break it today in the name of Jesus. Kila mguvu zinazo zuia kuendelea kwako na zivunja na zikemea katika jina la Yesu. Every power fighting your advancement, I break it today. I destroy them, I break them. You are free to advance. I release you to advance. Na kuachilia, na kuachilia. Ukasonge mbele katika jina la Yesu. Pokea neema. 
ya kusonga kwa jina la Yesu pokea neema ya kwenda mbele ya kusonga mbele kila kitu hizi kila nguvu zangizo na zivunja katika jina la Yesu tunavunja kila malango kila milima kila nguvu tunaziharibu ziko chini ya miguu yangu katika jina la Yesu moto wa roho mtakatifu ukakuondoe katika kila kifungo katika kila kifungo katika kila kifungo every resistance 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 i break your power i break your spirit I break your forces. I break your watch. I destroy your watch. Every resistance, every resistance must hear the word. Must hear God. Must hear God. Rabba kataba. Rabba shikaba. Rabba kataba. It must obey. It must come out. Thou spirit from hell. Thou spirit of the enemy. Thou spirit from hell. I destroy your power. I break it now. In the name of the Father, the Son and the Holy Ghost, you are free. You are free. You are free. Every hindrance to your progress, every hindrance to your advancement, it is now broken today. In a vunjika leo, in a vunjika leo, in a vunjika leo, na ita rudi tena, na ita rudi tena. Sande kwa ukombozi. Sande kwa ukombozi. Everybody say fire. Fire. Say fire. Fire. Say fire. Fire. One fire. Fire. Two fire. Fire. Three fire. Fire. Four fire. Fire. Five fire. Fire. Six fire. Fire. Break every chain. 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 Every chain. Every chain. Every chain. Every chain. Every chain. All the chains. She is free. She is free. All of you are free. Nyote mkohuru. All of you are free. Nyote mkohuru. Nauliza. Nani hapo? Anasema. Na, naomba niyo. Mbewe uokofu. Niyo mbewe uokofu. Niyo mbewe uokofu. Inua mkono nita kuambia msamaa wa dhampi. Na kuanzia hapo utaanza kuona Mungu akikuwezesha. E, nani anasema niombe uokofu? Msamaa wa dhambi. Kuna nguvu 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 za
huko mbali kabla hatujafunga na ungependa kuunganika na neema ya advancement unaweza kutuma sadaka yako katika namba za simu ambazo ziko pale na kama uko hapa pia na hujaunganika na hiyo neema you can connect with an offering tunapomalizia sasa hivi tutaimba mara moja there is power if you have an offering you feel you need to connect you are free to do that there is power power when the working power in the blood in zarala baba za kuketi Haleluya Waimbaji mnaweza kuketi Kabla hatujatoka ni sawa Steve Tumemaliza ibada e, neno 